Stay a while and listen. Hello, welcome to the Freak Show. Bumpy McSquiggums here. I want to thank you all for joining me as I start up my coverage of Katana Kami, A Way of the Samurai Story. It is by Acquire Corporation and Spike Chunsoft Co. And it released onto Steam, PlayStation 4, and Nintendo Switch on February 19th, 20. 20. I think I have all the settings correct. I haven't actually hopped in and played yet. We're about to experience it all for the very first time together. Let's do this thing. Losing in multiplayer when defeated by an opposing player. Something. Something indeed. Alright, what doth you have for me here? Ip Ipon Matsu, I think it said. Alright, so I am going to be using a PlayStation 4 controller to play said game. And many of you would ask, why don't you just play it on the PlayStation 4? I don't know. I still I still like to be a, a PC gamer for the most part. Alright, so I can randomly kick. I can do whatever that was. My bowing? Ooh! Uh, okay. Well, that's weird. Interesting. Alright, I, I don't really know what I'm doing. They didn't give us any kind of clue or tutorial or anything yet. So, interesting. It does not appear that I can jump, though. But I can do some sort of cool little uh, combinations with uh, punching and kicking. Oh, what's going on over here? There's a bunch of folk. That that sounds bad. It's Nanami. Papa! Wait, please! Not my daughter! You think you have a say in this? You should have paid your debt. I'm taking your daughter as collateral. Please! Not my daughter! Anything but my daughter! Don't worry, I will show you mercy. I won't sell her off yet. Yet. Curse you! Papa, I believe in you. I know you'll pay off your debt and save me soon. Well, this is awkward start, isn't it? Nanami, I'm sorry. <laughs> what was that laugh? Did you? I'm sorry. Ha <clears throat> ha, isn't that sweet? This display of familial love brings a tear to my eye. Anyway, Dojima. Good luck with everything. <laughs> this guy. Papa! Nanami! Yeah, okay. So, I mean, I want to be invested, but man, that was that was some over-the-top stuff. I liked it. I liked it. Alright, I'm invested. I I'm here. I'm, let's do this. What are we doing? What's up, Dojima? Uh, am I going to punch him if I hit that button? No, okay. Who are you? We're closed for the day. What is this place? What happened? What is this place? As you can see, this is a smithy. I'm the owner. The name's Dojima. I can make anything. Swords, kitchen knives, tools, you name it. But I'm in no condition to do that now. My daughter was taken from me. And you are? You don't look like you're from around here. My name is Samurai. Well, you know, my name's Sam. Oops. My name is Sammy. Sammy the Samurai. Oh yeah, we, we Sammy. <laughs> Sounds like a joke. It kind of was. Anyway, if you want something, come back tomorrow. I'm not in the mood to work today. Uh, look, I'll rescue your daughter. W what are you after? Your daughter, obviously. No, um, I don't know. No one would help me out of the kindness of their heart. I'll help if I can marry her? Well, maybe I wasn't wrong. I was looking for a wife. I'll make her happy. Well, it looks like I don't really have a lot of choices here. I mean, I do, but they're all the same thing. Um, uh, I guess I'll help if I can marry her? I mean, it, it, that seems blackmailish. This They all do. I'll make her happy? Uh, are you Not No, not really. I don't... Yeah, maybe? I'm not giving my daughter to some guy who walked in off the street. Well, I mean, what if she gets sold to a brothel? I can get her back in no time. No, 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 no any, any, anything but that. 
Well, you're on your own then. Leave it to me. What? Uh, fine. If you can really help repay my debt, I'll think about it. We have to get Nanami back as soon as possible. We'll talk about marriage after she's safe. Too many things happened today. I'm exhausted. I'm going to rest. I've got a place for you to sleep. Take it if you want. Um. Sure. Is that a doll? It's a creepy doll, whatever it is. Oh, I can. Oh, yep, yeah, nope, sure, we'll sleep. Yep. Good night. No. No. Okay. Let's go make a you know, nice little slow walk out here. Yep. I had a nap. Oh, there's a there's a something's going on over here. I don't know what. What what what's what what this? There's a portal in a tree. All right, I'm oh I'm game. Let's do it. Why do I feel like this is a terrible idea? It I can't read that that fast. I can't read the the cool Japanese words. So it was like Ipamatsu floor one something. Ah. Uh, what is Jaikai G G G K G K? I don't know. Where's it say? What is J K? How about that? Uh, when night falls, you can check the Impon Impon Matsu to enter Jakai. A magical place full of treasure and danger. Jakai is separated by various floors. If you enter a blue-colored well, you can go to the next floor. Oh, yeah? I'm ready. I will kick people in the shin. Oh, uh, sheathing and unsheathing. You should be prepared to unsheathe your sword at any time. L1 to sheathe or unsheathe. However, when your sword is unsheathed, your movement speed decreases and you can appear threatening to people. It's not all good. When you are in a safe area, it's best that you keep your sword sheathed. Okay. It's kind of an odd game mechanic, but fine. Basic controls. Weak, strong, destructive environments. Try breaking things everywhere you go. Okay. I mean, I can attack with it when I don't unsheathe. Look, see? Look, I just attacked that. I got some big coal, baby. That did not look like coal. I, oh, this is... I like this. Yeah. I just kick over giant mounds and stuff. Look at it. Yeah. Maybe I should unsheathe my sword. What do you guys think? But this candle, huh? Candle in the wind. <laughs> That's great. I can kick it. I pick it up off of kicking it. My apologies there, folks. Uh, unfortunately, I am always, 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 always struggling with hard drive space. And I had run out. I needed to uh, basically empty my recycle bin. So it is what it is. It's all good now. Everything is looking uh, mighty fine. We're back to kicking lumber and claiming stuff. See, we don't even need our... You know, I'm going to try my first battle with, with uh, just kicking some fools. I was able to do some sort of weird combo before. Remember, I was, like I was walking up and I was able to like, I don't know, I can't, I can't seem to do it now. I, I don't know what R2 does, but yeah, well, whatever. We're going to the next area. It's all good. It's all good. Cave floor. T oh god. Oh. Uh. Well. Um. Oh. Oh, that snake is real too. Oh no. Basic controls. Parry, and evade. Fight enemies. You have. You have to not only attack but also evade and defend. Area's guard and utilize these to defeat the enemy. Uh, I need my sword out or I can't do any of these things. Ow. Yeah! Ow! Oh my goodness, that snake hurt. Eh. Eh, I know I don't have my sword out. All right, it's time to. Uh. Okay. Oh, oh no! I'd actually really, really, really like my sword. There we go. Now we're talking. Ah! 
Uh-huh. Yeah, you thought you had me there, friend. Alright, cool. Tutorial experience level up has been added. Well, that was that was rough. I, I got slapped around a little bit, but the cool thing is you actually level up when you uh, or when you level up you actually heal. Um Ooh, that heavy attack's nice. I like how you can still affect the, the bodies on the ground. That's pretty cool. Okay, I'm all for it. I'm here. Oh. HP and vitality. While exploring, always be mindful of your HP and vitality. What is vitality? HP, you will die when this gets to zero. And when you sheathe your sword and stay still, you will consume vitality as you slow to regenerate. Ah. Consumed when doing strenuous actions like attacking. This will also be used to regenerate HP. When your vitality stays at zero for too long, something terrible will happen. Oh, well, that's good to know. How, how do we reclaim our vitality? What if we stand still? No. Is that a... Oh! I thought that was maybe a deer. It was not. It was not a deer. Oh, how to use items. You can use items to get through danger. Items can not only be used, but thrown as well. You can use items from the pause screen when you're in a rush. You can use shortcuts. Select, use, throw, to stuff. Okay. Did, did I did I get something? To the item bag. Item. Uh, are any of these actually usable? I don't think so. Um, those are all materials. Alright, we don't actually have any items yet. Okay, cool. I guess we'll get something out of here. It's a rat snake. Well, it was. Now it's a dead rat snake. Ow! Unexpected. Yeah, big old net. Oh man, look at all the all the blood splatty, splatty, spooch, splooch, splooches that we've been throwing out there. Uh, not cool. I mean, it's kind of cool. Very messy. Kind of makes you want some strawberry. Jelly. Orb and Katana time. What? When you defeat enemies in Jakai, they can drop objects of light called orbs. Orbs can be accumulated to charge up the orb gauge on the bottom of the screen. By accumulating the orbs, you can unleash the powerful Katana time. Uh, I charged up your orb gauge to show it to you. So, try using it. Hold R1 and press L1 to unleash. Orbs will not accumulate when you do not have a sword equipped. Oh, there's more. While in katana time, you will gain many benefits. Your sword will not break. My sword will break? What? Uh, you will move faster, you will have super armor, and your vitality will not go down. The orb gauge can charge up to three levels, making it stronger as it goes up. On level three, you can unleash secret arts. Special moves that can change, depending on your sword stance. Alright. I think I did that backwards, but you know what? It's cool. The little flowery stuff that's okay. So, my sword can break apparently. That's the thing that can happen. Well, that's not that's not cool, man. Is there a way to run? I can just fall down. What does this do? I can't wait to figure out what L what R1 does. I have sheathed my sword. That's right. That's right, huh? See that? Look at that. Don't even need a weapon. Alright, maybe I should have a weapon. Alright, oh, we can escape. I don't want to escape. I was having a blast down there. That was a lot of fun. Explorer grade. Well, I can't imagine it went very well for me. Explore, battle, harvest, levels reached, growth, traps tripped, general grade. I'm a little chick. Oh, well, that's weird. Uh, health damage from status ailments, good. Sword that defeated most monsters is the Heioto. Uh, favorite skill is Roller. I don't even know what that means. Uh, yeah, okay, sure. Whatever you say. Oh, and, okay. Daughter taken as collateral, Debt Dungeon. Do you know a man named Dojima? He runs a smithy and it 
Ipon Matsu, making swords to sell. This would, of course, make more sense back in the Edo period when samurai reigned. That even in the Meiji era, I'm sure I'm butchering this, and I apologize for everyone involved, he continues to forge his swords. It is difficult to make a living from this. As a matter of fact, he is heavily in debt. So far in debt that the debt collectors took Dojima's daughter, Nanami, as collateral. Perhaps he deserves it, but you can't help feel sorry for him. Perhaps out of concern, a young man has taken up helping poor Dojima. Today in Rokotsu Pass, I... Okay, I don't know what that means. Tensions relax. Tensions surrounding the Kurofu family seems to or seem to be resolved. The subjects, for whatever reason, are now preparing for a festival. The Kurofu family can be seen carrying around lanterns, festival drums, and a portable shrine. Memories of war still haunt the citizens of, oh gosh, Rokotsu Pass, so they welcome a peaceful cultural event like this. Sensei's lessons. I feel like fighting in the side stance today. Okay. What? Uh, Akadama clan resigns. The ominous atmosphere of aggression around the Akadama clan has been relieved. The members are starting to calm down from their previous state of anger. The clan members at the front line seem to have already retreated. Not a single speck of dust, let alone bloodstains, are present on the battlefield now. They reportedly cleaned the area as they retreated. Sure. Tensions wane. Tensions at Post Town seem to have dissipated, and the citizenry is starting to calm down. Residents are looking forward to resuming their normal lives. Suzu and Donald appear to be smiling more, too. Okay. We hope that this peace will continue, but that is unlikely, considering this is a Rokutsu. Rokutsu. Sure. Pass. Who knows when true peace will come to Post Town? Uh, today's haiku. I'm all grown up now, which is what I was after, and is half asleep. You know, I'm just, yeah. Nope, it's good. Oh, my. Ah! The next payment amount and deadline is set. We have one day remaining, we gotta get a hundred monies. Oh, God, time is passing. Oh, no. What do I do? Hey. Hey, what do I do? Give all your materials to Dojima. Where were you? I didn't see you around. I, I thought you would run off. Uh, there's a hole at the base of the tree. Uh, so that's where you went. About that. Uh, for some reason, that tree leads to a strange cave at night. Uh, how does that happen? Around these parts, we worship the blacksmith god called Lord Datara. That pine tree... Ippon Matsu is the incarnation of the blacksmith god. And that hole appearing at night is one of Lord Data, 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 Data whatever. Datara? Datatara? Datatara. It's mysteries. You can gather a lot of useful materials for smithing in that cave. How far in does it go? I sometimes go to gather materials, but it's not that deep. I've tried exploring it, but there are dead ends everywhere. But something weird happened once. One time, when I went to gather materials, I passed out from hunger. I woke up and found myself next to Ippon Matsu. Everything I had gathered in the cave was gone. I thought to myself, this is the, lo this is the doing of Lord Datara? Uh, Datara? Datara. I guess that's it. Tara, Datara. Yeah. He spared my life. I'm sure I'm completely pronouncing that wrong. I'm so, so sorry. I So I can't complain about my lost items. When you die, when your HP reaches zero in the Jakai, you will be forced back to the surface. Your money, your items, swords, everything else you had on your person will be lost. Be sure to watch your HP. Anyway, Benia, Benia is coming tomorrow to collect the debt. To be honest, I don't have the money. I'm relying on you. Uh, you weren't going to help? Leave it to me. I knew I could count on you. I know. I can give you this. I found it on the street over there. I was going to sell it, but no one bought it, so it's yours now. It's supposed to be pretty rare. You should be thankful. For your random street miracle medicine? Really, man? Really? Miracle medicine. Cool. I guess. Maybe. I don't... Nah, it's fine. Huh? Uh, ooh, what? Uh, Dojima actions. Get Dojima to look at your swords. Forge, consume materials to make swords stronger. Repair, consume another sword to replenish the sword's durability. 
Title give a sword a nickname to improve its stats and appraise unknown swords to fix cursed swords. Okay. Let's talk with them. What? Uh, how you doing? What's the next order? I'll show you what a master swordsmith can do. Uh, you suck at this job. You shouldn't work too hard. Hmm, well. Hey, I reduced the stress. Cool, I have a present for you. I I lied. I, I totally don't have a present for you. Yeah? Will, wait, will we check weapons? Um, carried sword. The Hayoto. Okay. Uh, what's where's my durability? Okay, it's uh 597 out of 700. Reinforce. How do you want to forge it? I need some materials first. I need a lot of materials apparently. I don't have much. All it would do is increase my swing by a little bit. Oh, we don't know because I don't have the materials. Wait, wait, wait. Proceed. Materials needed. Oh, I do have enough. Oh, yeah, no, we'll totally proceed. So, from 19 to 23. Okay. Oh, but we only get... Oh, we only get so many reinforcements. Okay. Okay, I kind of understand how this is working. Uh, I proceed with that. Use it wisely. I wonder if, like, there's, like, a chance for better, better success or worse success or how that works. So it's very interesting. I think we're okay. All right, let's quit that. What about a title? You need the title book to set a title. You can also transfer a title from another sword. Oh, that's cool. All right, what do I want? Ah, uh, nothing. I'm good. Um. Yeah, praise unknown swords. You don't have any curse swords. I don't have any. Quit. Okay, uh, talk. It's nothing. Alright, so what what do I do now? Do I do I lead? Do I talk to people? What do I I'm not sure. Whoa, I am so sorry, sir. I apologize. Uh Akadama member. Lord Kicho is serious about the future of this nation. Well, apparently I can run literally into people. What's up? Yeah. What should I do? I, I don't know. I don't even know who you are. Why are you asking me things like that? Come on now. Ah. There is no deeper meaning to my actions. I simply go with the flow. Alright, ladies and gentle people, let's head over to this weird purple blob on our map. Ooh, it's a vending machine. Hello. Welcome. Do I have any money? I do. I have a hundred purse. I don't know what that means. It's, it's fine. Wait. Allows you to revive on the spot when you die. Ooh, that sounds useful. Alright, cool. Alright. Nothing right now. I think I'm going to break off the episode right here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Like I said, we're just getting started. I'm very curious to see how this all plays out. I think it's going to be quite an interesting and, and kind of different game. Like, I, I was kind of looking over some of the reviews as I was getting ready to start up this uh, episode. And honestly, what I'm going to do is pause the game, too, because I don't want the time to keep slipping away. But um, somebody had mentioned that it's like a, a Diablo clone, and I it, it's absolutely not. That is not accurate at all. So, yeah, you guys got to see the game for yourselves. Hopefully, you enjoyed this. If you want more information about the game, where to get the game, information on the developer, the publisher, any of that wonderful fun stuff, it will all be down below in the description of the video and various links and things of that nature, just like it always is. If you are interested in the game, but you want to check it out a little bit more, or maybe you can't afford it right now, or you want to get it down the road, you're looking for sales, or whatever the case is, don't forget to wishlist the game, guys and gals. It's something I'm going to try to drive home moving forward, because it definitely helps developers a lot to see who is interested in their game, even if they're not able to pick it up right away. So go ahead and do that. Like I said, if you're interested in the game and you want to you know, keep tabs on it, maybe come back when it's on sale, or you get paid, or whatever the case is, do it. It's, just, it, it's a big help, so seriously. I will, I will always remind you guys to go ahead and do that whenever we're starting a new series. If you enjoyed, subscribe to the channel. There'll be more content like this and literally thousands of other videos you can go check out and watch and enjoy. And until the very next episode, my name is Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you for stopping by The Freak Show, and I will see you later. <laughs>